counted and a foul. And one. That is maybe the biggest play this game. I mean, Kawhi in clutch time. And if he makes this free throw, it's a one-point game. That's right. Ten-year-old Pepper Pursley is a rising star in women's basketball media and beyond. During quarantine, she created her Instagram Live talk show and podcast, Dish with Pepper. She called her first NBA playoff game this month for Game 5 of the Clippers and Mavericks first round series. And she joins us live this morning. Hello there, Pepper. Look at you. All Isn't she so cute? So delightful and cheerful. Well, take us take us to the beginning. How did this start? Why did this start? And and, and walk us through this, this whole journey of yours. Um, it's been really crazy. Um, I start well, my first interview was when I was six. Um, so technically I've been doing this for about four years now. Um and yeah, my first interview was of Sugar Rogers. Um, he was then playing for the New York Liberty. Um, and it was just such an amazing experience. It was driven by my curiosity, wanting to learn more about the WNBA and how everything works. And um, as you can see here, this was, um, I, I believe when I was seven, I was doing a lot of interviews to try to highlight the WNBA. And then after that, when I was eight, I was doing an anti-bullying project. And then last year I began and my um, Instagram live talk show and my podcast um, just to try to bring this fun on people's faces during the pandemic and to try to address social activism, um, police brutality, and to try to highlight the WBA. Pepper, you, uh, pardon us for not asking another question right away. I think we're all blown away by how yeah. <laughs> how poised you are. You, you don't seem like you're 10 years old. You are doing a fantastic job. Have, have people told you that? Yes, um, thank you. I, it's really amazing, honey. So tell us, how your did your dad have tickets to the WNBA and that's how you first got interested in it in the first place? Um, yeah, so um, our family tells this story a lot, but on my dad's side, four generations um, have been to New York Liberty Games, huh. um, which is, I think is really cool. So yeah, um, he had season tickets and I was able to go to those games and just fall in love with the W. Pe so, so Pepper, you've talked to a lot of athletes here uh, over the years here. Can you tell us who some of your favorites are? Um, I get this question a lot, and I really can't choose who my favorite interview is. There you go. Um, you're I, a really, journalist. Yeah, I really loved all of them. Love all of them. Good answer. Pepper, let me ask you this. How do you balance it all? Huh? <laughs> you got all this going on. You got school. You got recess. You got play dates and right? sleepovers. What do you, how, do you, how do you do it? You have a personal assistant? Do you have did Google help you? How, how, do you, how do you manage all this? Um, I guess you could say my parents are my personal assistants. Yeah, uh -huh. um, um, but they help me with everything. Help me with balance. Um, whenever I need help with anything that I'm doing, um, they're always there to give it to me and to help me out. So, um, yeah, shout out to them. But sometimes it is hard to balance. Um, and sometimes it's tough for me to feel like I'm still actually being a kid. But then I just try to anchor this on the fact that I know I'm doing what I love. All right, back to your parents. How much of a cut are they taking? I'll, I'll undercut them by 5% to manage and do whatever you want to do. I, got, I know a lot of people. We can book personal appearances, Pepper. You and me, we can take this thing. We take a rocket ship to the top, Pepper. So actually, all of the money that I get, um, I actually get to keep. And most of it goes to my college fund. Good for you. Um, yeah. That is so great. Hey, can I ask, do you play basketball yourself? Yes, I do. I love basketball. And do you want to be a journalist or do you want to play in the future? What do you think you want to do? Um, I definitely want to play um, college basketball and play in the WNBA. And then I would love to get back into journalism after that. Well, Pepper, that's pretty awesome because you're talking to a former high school basketball star herself and Robin. You probably know her from the Queen of Peace. Uh, Packers. Glory days, yeah, yeah. She was a stud back then. So yeah. look her I'm up. I'm sure she'll look A lot of literature yeah. on her. <laughs> He's lying, Pepper. I'm not, I wasn't good at all. So best of luck to you. You can find Pepper on Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter. Her information's on your screen. What a great girl. Pepper, pleasure to meet you. Thank you, Pepper. Thank you so much. Wow.